Rick and Morty season 7 is approaching on October 15, and we finally got the long-awaited voice reveal for the main characters. They have been teasing us with the information of who's gonna be voicing them for a couple of weeks now. First with season 7 episode title reveal, and then by promotion done exclusively by Bat and Summer. But finally, the season 7 trailer shows that the voices are... okay. You can definitely hear Rick sounding different, especially I think in these two clips. Who's ready for Rick's famous spaghetti? Whose car is this? Whose sun visor is this? What's a sun? But here, where he keeps a low voice, you can barely hear the difference. A rake situation? Train your child to lie, Jerry, even though, you know, tis the season. Mori has lost Roiland's squeaky voice that Roiland does for many characters. Unacceptable! Yeah, definitely that one! But the new voice is actually pretty close. I'm telling you, man, you're making a big... But maybe it's the previous season fan in me that's looking for any similarities. Maybe even these voices over time will become characteristic to Rick and Morty after some random meme pops out of nowhere. I'm Pickle Rick! I'm a leg. And then people will recognize it as the voice of Rick and Morty. It's also important to mention that this is only a trailer and for example the last scene where Rick screams Morty, we're back baby! Seems uncanny and out of place for me at least. But it might be because trailers sometimes cut out some text from dialogue to keep the pace and in result the lips don't quite sync in some places. So we need to hear a regular dialogue to know for sure how it sounds and if it's uncanny or not. I also will be very disappointed if they don't acknowledge their new voices during the season. Because the show is known for constantly breaking the fourth wall. And they also often mention real life events. So, you know, just a small joke like someone says, Oh, you guys sound different or something. Or maybe they say it themselves. Interesting fact, the season's banner shows Rick's spaghetti. Ketchup making them look like covered in blood. And also at the end of the trailer behind the title. Probably there's a reason for the theme being these spaghetti. But will they be important for the lore? We'll see. Maybe it's Rick's prime spaghetti to mind control Rick and... I I'm not good at theories. Okay, bye.